Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his monthly bill? It's over 9,000! What, 9,000? There's no way that can be right! Hello, welcome to James the Lesser Express Line, where we get you in and out as fast as possible. Before I start playing this video, I want to remind you, he has spent over $40,000 in a single year before on WWE Champions. It came out in 2017. So let's use a bit of 2024 to make up for any months he may have been a little short on. So 40000 times six years, $240,000. And that's now counting Supercard and Street Fighter Duel and Dokken Battle and Estevez and all the other games he's played. This fucker has blown over a quarter million dollars on gacha games. He's probably closer to 300 if not more, over $300,000 on gacha games in the past 10 years. Easily. Let's watch. Basically, the po I, I, like, what is the point? They're underwater. They're, they're never really going to ski. So literally, he has the most pointless thing possible in an underwater base. You're never going to go to Hawaii, but you're wearing a Hawaiian shirt. Base, you would never need this kind of clothing, ever, right? Like, what would you ever need it for? Yeah, I guess the only reason you would shop here is to show you have money to, to blow, right? It's kind of like people today who wear a fancy watch. It's like, why do you wear a watch? There's no point. Everyone has a phone that has the, the clock on it now. Gee, I'm at work. I need to check the time. Do I dig in my pocket, get my phone out, double tap it? Oh, there's a time. Or look at my wrist. Oh, look at that. There's a time. So no one would ever need a watch ever. But if someone has a fancy watch, like they're wearing a Rolex or something, it's like, oh, I see. You're rich. I have, a, I have a Movado watch. Oh, you see, you just blow your money on stuff, right? Why the hell would anyone grab a business card? My watch, which I bought last year for a very big discount. No, I would never, ever, ever buy a Movado watch full price. I guess I'll show it to you to show you what it looks like if I can get out of the box. Here, you look at my business card. <laughs> Extreme close-up of my business card while I try to open this. You can see a little bit. See, Bridgeport, he had his address on there. And then let's continue. Box. There we go. Son of a bitch. Come on, camera. Maybe if I zoom in. Amazing work, DSP. There uh, you uh, go. Oh, oh. Too far. It's a nice red face, metallic hands. They actually glow in the dark. I like it a lot, but I rarely wear it, and here's why. My arm, especially during the summer, sweats a lot. And it sticks to my arm. It's very, very annoying. I got another watch out here. Um, another business card holder. This is the one I actually took. Man with multiple watches that he doesn't wear because he sweats in the summer. The fuck, DSP. And again, easily $300,000 on gotcha in the past 10 years between all the various games he's played. But you're going to sit there, Guy, why would you spend so much money on a watch? That much ago, thank you for watching. As always, like, subscribe, comment down below, and have one hell of a day.